How mahagad? Min yang isim yam Andy. Khal darang nisak. Hello, my name is Andy. How are you? Let's talk about the Bashkir language. Or... Bashkirt tele. Bashkir is a Turkic language belonging to the Kipchak branch. It is co-official with the Russian in Bashkortostan. It is spoken by approximately 1.4 million native speakers in Russia, as well as in Ukraine, Belarus, Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan, Estonia, and other neighboring post-Soviet states, and among the Bashkir diaspora. It has three dialect groups, Southern, Eastern, and Northwestern. Bashkir together with Tatar belongs to the Bulgaric subgroups of the Kipchak languages. They share the same vocalism and vowel shifts that make both languages stand apart from most other Kipchak and August Turkic languages. Bashkir, along with Russian, is the official language of the Republic of Bashkortostan. The language is used in education. For instance, it is studied as a subject and used as a medium of instruction in elementary and secondary schools, as well as at the university level. The Bashkirs, or Bashkortar, are a Kipchak Turkic ethnic group indigenous to Russia. They are concentrated in Bashkortostan, a republic of the Russian Federation and in the broader historical region of Bajgard, which spans both sides of the Ural Mountains, where Eastern Europe meets North Asia. Smaller communities of Bashkirs also live in the Republic of Tatarstan. The oblasts of Pyarmkrai, Chelyabinsk, Orenburg, Chumying, Sverdlovsk, and Kurgan, and other regions in Russia, sizable minorities exist in Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan. The modern Bashkir's genetic makeup is made up on average of approximately 60% West Eurasian or European and 40% Siberian or East Asian mitochondrial DNA genetic material. The ethnic Bashkir population is estimated at 2 million people. The 2010 Russian census recorded 1,584,554 ethnic Bashkirs in Russia, of which 1,172,287 1,172,287 Bashkirs live in Bashkortostan. That is 29.5% of the total population of the Republic. The Bashkir group was formed by Turkic tribes of South Siberian and Central Asian origin, who before migrating to the Southern Urals, wandered for a considerable time in the Aral Surdaria steppes, which is modern-day Central Southern Kazakhstan coming into contact with the Pechenegh August and Kima Kipchak tribes. Therefore, it is possible to note that the Bashkir people originate from the same tribes which compose the modern Kazakhs, Kyrgyz, and Nogais, but there has been a considerable cultural and small ethnic exchange with August tribes. The migration to the valley of the southern Urals took place between the end of the 9th century and the beginning of the 10th century, in parallel to the Kipchak migration to the north. The name Bashkortostan derives from the name of the Bashkir ethnic group, while the root of the name is Turkic, being a combination of Bash, which in Turkish can mean head, chief, main, principal, and Kort, meaning wolf, one of the animals regarded as sacred to Turkic peoples. The suffix Stan is Persian, common to many Eurasian territorial names. The Bashkir or Bashkort, Bashkort atu, is the horse breed of the Bashkir people. The Bashkir was used as a draft and utility horse and as a producer of milk and meat. It is raised mainly within Bashkortostan. The principal center of breeding is the capital, Ufa. The Bashkirs have a style of overtone singing, called Uzlev, which has nearly died out. In addition, Bashkorts also sing Uzlev while playing the Kurai, a national instrument. This technique of vocalizing into a flute can also be found in folk music as far west as the Balkans and Hungary. The Bashkirs have a rich folklore, referencing the genesis and early history of the people. Ural Batur, from Ural plus Turkic Batur, means hero or brave man, is the most famous epic poem of the Bashkirs. It is a telling of heroic deeds and legendary creatures, the formation of natural phenomena, and so on. The Bashkirs traditionally practiced agriculture, cattle rearing, and beekeeping. The half-nomadic Bashkirs travel through either the mountains or the steppes, herding cattle. Wild hive beekeeping is another attested tradition. 
Traditional Bashkir dish, bishbarmak or kulama, is prepared from boiled meats and halma, a type of noodle, sprinkled with herbs and flavored with onions and some korot, young dry cheese. Dairy is another notable feature of the Bashkir cuisine. Dishes are often served with dairy products and few celebrations occur without serving of korot or kaimak, sour cream. Bashkir first appeared in writing in a runic alphabet during the 9th century AD. It was written with the Arabic script between the 10th century and 1928, when it was replaced by the Latin alphabet, which itself was replaced by the Cyrillic alphabet in 1940. The modern alphabet used by Bashkirs is based on the Russian alphabet, with the addition of nine letters. Bashkir has nine native vowels and three or four loaned vowels, mainly in Russian loanwords, and has 28 consonant phonemes. A member of the Turkic language family, Bashkir is an agglutinative SOV language. A large part of the Bashkir vocabulary has Turkic roots, and there are many loanwords in Bashkir, from Russian, Arabic, and Persian sources. It is characterized by vowel harmony, which places limitations on which vowels may be contained in a word. Bashkir syllables can end in a vowel, or in one or two consonants. There are no syllable initial consonant clusters. Stress in Bashkir words is normally placed on the final syllable of the word. The placement of the original stress in loan words is usually preserved. In the next part, let's hear the beautiful sounds of their language. Numbers Ber Ike Us Durt Bish Alte Yete Higet Tugat Un Greetings and Phrases how mahagat? Khair lirte. Khair lekun. Khair letun. Salam. Rahimitigat. The kuru ma shotman. Salam. Khaldarin nisek. Vocabulary. Ayu. Etes. Bure. Vagon. Gul. Ghalim. Daga. Yilek. Yo. Zeraf. Zetun. The Ishek Yeigur Kubelek Kuyan Lele Maimul Nur N Oyok Uy Palm Rakete Seret S Terpe Usak Urmexin Fil Hat Hayer Cirk Chukche Sherche Shotke Katalak bildehe, Lassen, Yumshaklak bildehe, Ed, Yula, Yarma. The Parable of the Prodigal Son. Raisa Hila Wenda Wamitken. Berkishening Ikula Bulgan. Kesula Atahana. Atai, Mulkatin Mingati Shlulushan Bulipirtigan. Ataha Mulkatin Uldarana Bulipirgan. Berni Sekunutkes, Kesula Udilushan Hatup. Бөтә аҡсаһын алып алыҫ юлға сығып киткән, һәм унда аҙғынлыҡҡа бирелеп, байлығын туҙҙырып бөтөргән. Бөтөнөһөн пыран-заран килтергәндән һуң, был илгә ҡаты аслыҡ килгән, һәм ул мохтажлыҡ кисерә башлаған. Шул саҡ ул ошо илдең бер кешеһенә эшкә ялланған. Был кеше уны ялынға сусҡа көтөргә ебәргән. Кесе ул шул тиклем асыҡҡан, хатта сусҡаларҙың аҙығын ашарға ла риза булыр кимәлгә иткән, әммә уға уныһын да бирмәгәндәр. Шул саҡ ул аҡылына килеп, атайымдың ялсылары күп, һәм уларҙың бөтәһенең дә туйғансы ашарлыҡ ризығы бар, ә мин бында астан үлеп арам. Хәҙер үк ҡайтайым да уға, атай, мин күктәге Алла ҡаршыһында һәм һинең алдында гонаһ ҡылдым. Инде һинең улың тип аталарға лайыҡ түгелмен, мине ялсы итеп эшкә ал тип әйтәйем, тип уйлаған. Шунан һуң атаһы янына ҡайтып киткән. Алыҫта килә ятҡанында уҡ уны атаһы күреп ҡалған һәм бик йәлләгән. Каршыһына югереп барып, косаклап увып алған. Улы уға, «Атай, мин күктәге Алла каршыһында һәм һинең алдында гонаһ кылдым. Инде һинең улың тип аталырға лайыҡ түгелмен», тигән. Ә атаһы үҙенең хезмәтселәренә, «Иң хәйбәт кейемдәр алып килеп уны кейендерегеҙ. Бармағына йөҙөк кейдерегеҙ. Аяҡтарына каталар бирегеҙ. Һимертелгән берәй быҙауҙы салығыҙ. Аша весеп күңел асайыҡ. Минең улым үлгәйне, хәҙер терелде. Юғалғайны, хәҙер табылды, тип әйткән. Шунан улар күңел аса башлаған. 
Атаның үлкен ол иһә қырза болған. Қайтышлай үйіне яқынайып келгенде ер һәм бейу тауыштары ишеткен. Хизметселердің біріхін сақырып, бұнда неме бара тип хораған. Хенің қустың қайтты. Атайың оны хау сәлемет көруіне қуанып, химертілген бұдау салдырды теген оға хизметсі. Үлкен олдың бұға асуы келген, әм үйге инерге тіләмеген. Атағы сығып сақырғас, оға ол бұлай теген. Бұна мен хенге не сәйілдар енді хизмет етем. Бұйрығыңды бір тапқырда өтемай қалғаным еқ. Шулай болғала, достарым менен көңіл асырға бір тапқыр кәзә бәрәселә бірменің. Әмелкенді азғын қатындар менен тұздырған бұл олың қайтқас, оның үсін қатта еміртілген бұзау салғанхың. Атағы оға, ұлым, хен әр вақыт янымда, менің бар нәмәм хенікі. Бұл құстың үлгейні терілді, юғалғайны табылды, бұна ұшы қуаныстан көңіл асырға болдық, деген.